Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate private whitelist users on LinkedIn through Socinator. Whitelisted users are the LinkedIn accounts you want Socinator to interact with. So these are the users you want to protect. Adding them on the whitelist will make things easier for you. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your LinkedIn account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the account configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on LinkedIn through Socinator. Let's scroll to the right and click Private Whitelist Users. There are two areas. On the left, we can enter the LinkedIn usernames to add to our whitelist. Let's say user1. Since we can only add one username per line, so let's enter, then user2. You may clear using the clear users list over here, and they're gone. So let's type them again, user1, enter, user2. When you're ready, let's click the green button, add to whitelist. And they're successfully added. If not everyone shows up, then you can click the refresh button over here. So these are the whitelisted users. You may remove users from the whitelist if you want. So you can select one, or if you want to select several ones or all of them, you can click select all and it will select everyone. And when you're ready to remove, let's click the blue button, remove selected from whitelist, and they're gone. Now, let me show you another option in automating private whitelist users on LinkedIn through Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop down button and select LinkedIn. This will take us to the Accounts tab. Let's switch to the Settings tab and select Whitelisted Users on the left side of the app. So let's apply the same steps from earlier. So User1, Enter, User2. Because only one LinkedIn username per line, again, you may clear using this button. And when you're done, let's click the green button, Add to Whitelist. And it says successfully added, but you can't see them. So let's click the refresh button and there they are. Again, you may select one or you may select all if you want to remove users from the whitelist. And when you're ready, let's click the blue button, remove selected from whitelist and they're gone. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.